A few years ago, Slack moved away from jQuery and embraced modern frameworks like React and Redux all within a single Electron process. But of course, Electron is slow slash resource hungry. Users that had to manage multiple workspaces had their computer converted into a jet engine. Let's look at how they made Electron faster with less memory consumption. Electron acts as a container for web applications, allowing Slack to run as a desktop app using web technologies. By consolidating all workspaces into a single Electron process. Redux is a predictable state container for JavaScript apps. Slack uses Redux to manage application states across multiple workspaces efficiently. This means changes in one workspace don't require reloading or impacting others. In the new architecture, all workspaces run within one Electron instance, minimizing memory usage and CPU overhead. There's also centralized state management within Redux. Redux maintains a global state object for all workspaces. Each workspace is a slice of that state, and Redux ensures that state changes are efficiently propagated without unnecessary re-renders. Another big change was lazy loading. React components for each workspace are loaded as needed. So what's the big deal? More bloat to an Electron app? No, up to 50% less memory consumption, and the app loads 33% quicker and joining calls is now 10 times faster. Switching between workspaces is instantaneous with no lag or heavy resource swapping. This is a great future-proof solution and maybe it was more of a business solution because at the time Slack was growing in users and had to retain those users. And maybe Electron isn't so bad.